the Middle East public transport systems have changed over the decades with the addition of metros, trams as well as high-speed rail networks. But the transportation sector is definitely up for further transformation with the recent introduction of Hyperloop and now Skypods. In today's episode of Construction Week in Focus Season 4 with me Ranju Warrior, we will look into how transportation projects such as Skypods and cable cars are changing the way people would travel from one place to another. Dubai is stepping up the development of futuristic mobility solutions through suspended transport technology. And in doing so, last week, Dubai's Road and Transport Authority, which is RTA, signed an agreement with Beam Car Limited, which is considered as one of the largest developers of Skypods in the world, to develop Skypods in Dubai. Under the agreement, Beam Car will develop Skypods that are known for their speed, safety and efficient use of resources in the Emirate. In fact, what is more interesting about the Skypods is that they occupy less land area for operations, which is multiple times less than the conventional means of transportation of the same capacity. Moreover, Skypods are power efficient, small sized, lightweight units that are mounted with steel wheels which can run on suspended rails making them a source of transformation in itself for the transportation industry as a whole. According to the Director General and Chairman of the Board of Directors at RTA, His Excellency Mother Mohammed Al Tayyar, the addition of Skypods support RTA's efforts to deploy autonomous transit means in line with the Dubai self-driving transport strategy that is aimed at diverting 25% of total mobility journeys in Dubai to autonomous transit means by 2030. In February 2019, His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Vice President and Prime Minister of the UAE and ruler of Dubai, reviewed the unibike and unicar models of Skypod's futuristic transport system on the sidelines of the World Garment Summit. The Emirate of Sharjah is not far behind. The Sharjah Research Technology and Innovation Park, which is SRTI Park, is working on the hanging track transport system called the Skyway project, which is being developed by Skyway Technologies. The project's phase one, which includes the development of a 400 meter long elevated string track and Skyway stations to transport passengers is 80% complete, with work having begun on phase two. The second phase of the project involves the development of a 2.8 km long elevated track to transport cargo, including containers and bulk transport. Not far away in Jordan, the Jordan Free and Development Zones Group, which is JFDZC, is developing the Al Jhon Cable Car Project in Al Suwan Development Zone. The project that would be completed by June 2021 is being implemented by Wolfred Austria-based ropeway manufacturer Doppelmayr. Phase 1 of the project includes building the parts of the cable car project. Meanwhile, Phase 2 covers the construction of a conference centre, a five-star hotel, lodging areas and a restaurant. That's all from us at Construction Week in Focus. Don't forget to hit the like button and share the video with your friends and colleagues. We will see you very soon in another interesting episode. Until then, thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.